Hi all, this is Rob Koblenz. Hey, I wanted to go over something that I noticed with uh, the pre-service slides. Uh, one extra step that needs to be taken before we import them, as well as somebody asked if I could do a quick uh, instructional on how to import the uh, sermon. So it's really the same step. So pre-service slides, importing them in um, is pretty much the same, the same method, but I'll go ahead and do both. So all right, so make sure that, uh, number one, when you guys are bringing stuff in, that you're saving it into the correct documents. So you'll go to, into Documents, Pre-Service Slides, that's where we saved it. Um, so we're going to import this in, and I'm going to show you the little one, less, one more step that we need to take. Okay, and it's going to ask me where to save that. We want to save that on all other slides and media. Okay, hit OK. That's where the pre-service slides will go. Let's write over. Okay. Now that we have that, now we need to bring it in. Um, there it is. So let's click on pre-service slides. Go to all other, all other slides and media. And then we're going to just drag this in. Okay. Um, from here, this is what we we're running into yesterday. When we clicked on this, um, for one, this wasn't working. When we, I'm just going to do five seconds. We usually do ten seconds. Um, this was not doing anything, and of course, it is today. So, what happened? I don't know. Let's see if it'll do the music. Yeah. Okay. Well, yesterday this wasn't working, the, the transition thing. Um, and it was doing what exactly what we saw. Every time it transitioned, it would cut the music. See, it cuts the music. We can't even play it. So there's one extra step that needs to be taken in order to um, I'm gonna turn this off in order to make sure that this functions right and that we have music. So you're gonna, we're gonna select all these, um, or you can do Command A. Right click and see this, convert media action to slide element. That is one additional step that we need to make sure that we take when making these pre-service slides. So I'm gonna click on this, okay. Um, we'll go ahead and do, I'm just gonna do five seconds. I know we do 10 seconds typically, but just for, purposes of what we're doing here. I'm going to click on music and click the first slide. And it is going to the next slide. So that's good without cutting the music. So that's a good thing. So that is the one additional step we need to make when we're doing that. So hopefully that made sense on how we're bringing it in. Make sure that when you bring it in that you're choosing the correct library. Um, really no one should be doing anything with Ableton. I'm pretty much managing that. Um, so make sure you don't import it there. All other slides and media, it's like the five before, closing, communion, pre-service slides, sermon bumper. As you can see, all these are the items that would be included in this library. Offering, that is just your um, scripture, Bible verses for like the offering time. Sermons, that's pretty self-explanatory. Only the sermons and then all songs. This is all the songs. Um, so if you bring in a new song, this is where you'll do that. Okay? Again, Ableton, don't worry about doing anything with that. Okay, so that is that. Now, someone asked if, you could, if I could uh, show you how to import the sermon. The process is the same as we did with the pre-service slides. We're going to make sure when we bring it in that we're putting it into sermon imports. So this is where the messages will be. Um, when Rick brought in his message, he had the, the slides separate. It wasn't imported. It wasn't actually built into his um, message. So I just kept those uh, pictures in in here in the sermon imports and then just dragged them in so um, ideally 
everything's done though, you shouldn't have to, to add that in um, separately. So let's go to the message. What we're going to do is hit File, Import, File, and again, go to Documents, Sermon Imports. Okay, we're going to, this is the one that uh, Pro7 that Rick did. We're going to import that. We're just going to make sure we go to the correct library. So that's Sermons. Hit OK. And I'm going to apply all and just keep the existing so that I don't have to bring in those, uh, those pictures that were separated. OK, there's that. Now we need to make sure we assign it to the message area. This is where we need to put it. Go to the Sermons library and slide this in. Just drag it in. Okay. Um, I'm not going to show you how the, um, you know, the screen should look. That's a different video. But that is the process for dragging in the message along with the pre-service slides and the extra step. If you have any questions about any of this, let me know. Take care.